3 p.m. And I've not eaten anything today. Pregnant woman. But I don't know what happened. I just started crying for no reason. Oh my goodness. It was such a pleasure. Oh, it almost woke you like you went to work for like a few seconds. Pain like it. I don't even know how to explain it. Child. I can't pick any tissue green. what you feel like it's in this life aspire to Maguire. <laughs> hi guys so welcome back to the vlog <laughs> so there's this spa spag a spaghetti from spa that is my new favorite like this now it started with amala I, like i was using amala almost every day now it's spa because the time i had cravings for corn maize roasted corn that's soft, that's soft that's one but that one did last long actually my cravings has been one of the most interesting aspects of my pregnancy has been the roller coaster ride of food cravings and aversions. From being able to eat my favorite dishes, I'm in love with this particular one. There are two of them here. I don't want the second one, it's this particular one. <laughs> but it just feels dry and sweet. To suddenly developing aversions to meat and sugar. I can't take anything sugar. Cool. I even tried taking this Sims lemon, thinking that it's fat because it's Sims and lemon. But here is my case. I can't take meat too. Any protein, meat too. <sighs> it's been quite a journey. Thankfully, for the most part, I was able to cook meals myself. <laughs> However, at some point, the thought or even smell of certain foods made me nauseous. So those times when I'm unable to cook myself, my husband steps in. This is the closing for the moment. And I decided to be, be helpful and supportive by making us good. My husband made perfect this life. You put a uh, banana. Wait, I need to put banana here. Maybe what about? Thanks. Fashion thanks. My face, yeah. Where I put banana myself. This like, this double fast bread though. Is it? It's not even midnight snack. It's just nice snack. We had dinner, but just take something light. I've got to put banana in my hand. It's not that I'm even hungry. You go cool. As the updates, my fantastic. But what's the meaning of 52 calories per sandwich? Is it the whole of this or one spoon? Let me know. Even though, girl, even though, I go see top of It's supposed to be burning calories. Calorie burner, my god. This is the real good record. 52 calories is for energy now. Abby, we have of grams and calories. Which one is more? Carbohydrates is 2G, 2 grams. And other times, we just you know, buy food. Soups. Oh, those delicious soups from that Instagram vendor. <laughs> A lifesaver. so selective when it comes to food some days i like or want this thing another day is just something else now it's capricorn one day it was not another day it was cook today's capricorn who took four capricorn one two three four <laughs> oh jerry oh. This minute, I'm not able to eat so much. So it's past 3 p.m. and I've not eaten anything today. Pregnant woman. Yeah, and that's because I'm not hungry. I don't know. I just feel filled. Unnecessarily, sometimes it's like that that I won't feel like eating anything for a very long period of time during the any day. The next minute, I'm eating a lot. A few moments later. I don't pray that I'm eating much. Okay, today is just like. What's that look that you're giving me? 
I'm not understanding myself today. I have eaten chin chin, chocolate, rice and beans. Then normal rice and stew and egg. What did I eat again? Same more. Dark cook. And now I'm eating bread and juice. And another chocolate. This is got food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You are too faithful to fail me, oh Jesus. But again, some days are like this. <laughs> it's so strange. I'm trying to reduce the rate of sweet I take drinks. All this carbonated polluted drinks. So I won't be taking to the attachment. I'll drink what I said. Oh, I didn't get it very well, but <laughs> well, I tried. So now let me share with you a little story that brings a smile to my face whenever I remember. So one day I had this intense craving for moi moi and then I set out on a mission to find it. It was actually in the night but not late. Little did I know that I would end up being gifted with it by a kind stranger on the street. It was such a moment of pure. It was just one moment that I will not forget. So I had been craving it, moin moin and echo. I think I lost the video where I talked about it but I'm just going to do this voiceover. Craving moin moin and echo for a while and that my area like is not somewhere that I could really easily find it. So I embarked on the journey and set out on the mission. I was looking for moin moin and echo on the streets. I got to a particular place. I was passive it so i was trying to trace where the aroma was coming from i went through i noticed some guys like they are drinking alcohol at the side of the road right so i noticed they were the one eating my way <sighs> i was just like okay let me go forward maybe where they got it was not far i went to the end of the street i didn't see anybody selling me so when i was coming back and i went there and i asked them they were like maybe four or five guys like grown-up men <laughs> there was a lady amongst them so i just called one of them that was standing and holding the moment now i was standing separately from the guy from the gang so like, i was like hello there sorry to bother you i'm perceiving my mind and i've tried tracing where the odor is coming from but i could not even locate it there where did they get it from? Because I want to buy. He now mentioned one place. I can't remember. I now thought that, oh, that name is the pe name of the person selling it. The name sounds strange because I was not so familiar with <laughs> Lagos. And I said, okay, that where is the woman? And I said, no. And I told me that, oh, that is far from here. I'm like, oh, okay. I was so sad because I was like so desperate for it, right? I was sure now like walking away from them. I was just like, oh, thank you. It was not like I should come that they have excess that I should come and take. I was like, ah, no, 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 that you should not worry. My head, I'm like, eh, you say what, what? <laughs> I was like, oh, that you should not worry that. Thank you so much. So I was walking away, even though, eh, ah, in my mind, I'm like, where can I get this money? My God. He actually persuaded me so much, like maybe two or three times. Like one other person joined. I was just like, oh, that you should not worry that. Thank you. So while I was going, I was already walking like a little distance away from them. A lady now ran towards me with like, like the nylon wrapped my mind. It was not like, oh, the hello. Obviously, my, my tummy was already protruding like a little, so they already know that <laughs> this one is pregnant. <laughs> it's a craving that is pursuing all around. So she was not like, her brother wants me to have it, that they actually have excess that is remaining, that I can have it, that it's not a problem. This I was like, wow. I could not like reject it anymore. I was just like, I was so happy to be honest. I was like, ah, thank you so much. Thank you very much. God bless you. Like the way I was praying for them, and I thanked the other guys too for my fight. Told them, oh, thank you so much. Ah, <sighs> you guys, I was so happy. That's why I went home, took my moi moi, and then I now went to another like side of the street in search for a echo. echo is I don't know. I put it on the screen if I know the English word for it. So that was why I went to get the echo, and I go back home. That was why I got my echo and moi moi that day. Do you know? Hmm. Sometimes when you are craving something, eh, when they dash you, that's when it's sweeter. <laughs> like that moe moe was very delicious. Like I loved it. Like I enjoyed it. I balanced well and finished it. So happy. I was not narrating the gist to my husband. Uh, yeah. I collected food for stranger. It was like, eh? You collected food for stranger. From where? Where do you know them? How? <laughs> 
so i now just did him how everything went and yeah so that was that gist too there you have it <laughs> thank you for watching please like comment share subscribe and all that good stuff Bye. it's good to eat what you feel like it's in this life aspire to maguire <laughs> when you feel like eating anything in this life ensure that you eat it <laughs> oh my goodness it was such a pleasure may the almighty continually provide for us so that we can eat what we feel like it's because in this life food is very important no matter what you are going through eat <laughs> because that might actually solve a lot of problems some people when they are hungry they will be happy and they, they know them there <laughs> <laughs> you wanted to eat this rice and vegetables since <sighs> I'm so happy about it Baby, I saw on the stories that the husband was videoing the wife The wife was pregnant in the midnight She wanted roasted corn or something She had corn this at 1am The wife was not crying because the husband could not give her What do you have to say? <laughs> No, do you see I'm saying this here? Eh? When I first saw that video, you know, comment section is always filled with different thoughts and psychology. Somebody now said the man is shameless. Instead of you to go and get what she wants, you are there making video of her. Do you and laughing? What's funny? In my head, I'm not like, what do you want him to do? People too were not commenting on that. Like, how do you think? Where do you want him to go and see roasted corn at 1 a.m.? Uh, if he goes outside and see uh, if he goes out and he sees roasted corn or boiled corn at that time, will he should he buy it? <laughs> 1 a.m. Uh -uh. Who will be roasted corn for? Is it dead people that are roasted corn for? So actually, the point I want to make is that got me thinking of something. Somebody said in the comments that all these cravings that it's not like you should not crave that when it comes to Nigerian, everything is extra. That she or Igbo people do they bake babies? First of all, the comment about Igbo people is wrong. I don't know if I told you about one. The lady was craving McDonald burger at midnight. Like she could not sleep. Now as to wake her husband. Of course, and any even if it's woman, anybody will be like, I've woken you up before now. I said, I want cold watermelon. <laughs> Beyonce said, please, see why. Please, see why. Can you wait till the morning? Please. <laughs> Shasha, summary of the story is that guy went to buy it. No. God bless you. That's what I wanted to say that. They run 24 hours there. Because he could see. That's why that one makes sense. But where do you want somebody to go and do for roasted corn at that time? And I'm not saying that she should not now be emotional. It's not bad. Almost can make you be emotional and she's crying. It's not, I don't see any big deal there. I'm sure that after that time, when she's watching that video later, she will even laugh at herself. So, another person now says something that all these cravings, women used to over, over do it, that is, is actually controllable. Do you think that there are some cravings that are not controllable? Because me too, I feel like it's controllable. Even though the way he said it, the manner as which he said it, I don't really like the manner. But for example, me now, it's not like I don't crave cravings. First of all, I know that there are some people that have, have it worse. I can crave something today. If I don't get, see it that day, it might, it might be that before the week runs out, I'll try to get it. still controlled. Is it possible that there are some that are not controlled, controllable? Because it means that it is a do or die affair. If it means that it's uncontrollable, that you must get it now. Maybe something will happen to the person. <laughs> so what do you guys think? Bye for now.